Now we're going to look at the voice, the reader functions in Zoom Text Magnifier Reader. And if I switch the voice on, voice enable. and I go to a document that I have in the background, I can then arrow up and down. What is touch typing? And it will read the document touch to me. Typing is typing without using the sense of sight to find the keys. Specifically, a touch typist will know their location through muscle memory. A touch keys. And we can stop that talking with a control key. But if I go Zoom back to Zoom my settings, reader, voice chat. and I'll just switch off the voice. I can just tap it, or it's actually giving me the keyboard shortcut, so I could do caps lock, alt, and enter to switch off the voice. Now the um, options we have here, we can change the rate, we can also do that with a shortcut so we can make it a bit slower if we need to listen more carefully. And then we have these different echo um, settings. So the keyboard echo is basically how much you want Zoom text to say when you're typing. The mouse echo is how much you want Zoom text to speak when you're moving around with your mouse and then the verbosity gives us different levels of how much Zoom text is going to say. So for example, if I switch the voice on voice enable. and um, I go to my document. Touch so the keyboard echo I have set at the moment is words. So if I start typing, it's not reading the letters, but when I press space, Hello. it will read the word that I just typed. You can have keys and you can have keys and words um, echoed as you're typing. Zoom text, magnifi Zoom text magnifier reader. Voice and on chat. the mouse, have here, mouse. No echo for example, uh, we have no echo set, but if I set it to instant. Mouse echo set to instant mode. Zoom text magnifier reader. Now everything I point to is going to be read to me. Zoom text voice licensed to sight and sound technology deal through muscle member fingers in a horizontal Okay, so that could get very noisy. Um, so we can mouse, adjust mouse that jet, to hover mouse, instead. Hover, instant, no echo. So you'd have mouse, to mouse hover echo, over distance. something before it would actually read it out to you. Um, if we then, if we didn't actually need the voice all the time, we could switch voice the voice disabled. off and then we can use the reading tools instead. So we can launch different reading tools, app view, text view, and speak it tool. Um, and these will read the whole of an application to you or the text reader will put it into a wrapped column and speak it tool, which I'll just show you here now, will let you select reader, something you want to tool. read. So I can basically select some text. Hello touch typing is the sense of sight to find the keys. Specifically, a touch typist will know their location through muscle memory. So it just reads what I uh, highlighted there. And just to quickly show you also the um, text view. So if I do my shortcut, Hello touch typing is typing without using the sense of sight to find the key. And I can pause that, pause and play, play. At the top. And it's basically put it all in one long column. So that if that's easier to read, you can change all these colors as you would expect. And it just takes a lot of strain out of reading long documents like this.